Dear students, welcome back to the chapter algebraic expressions. Already we have learned addition of algebraic expressions. Today we are going to learn how to subtract algebraic expressions. To subtract algebraic expressions, just change the sign of each term of the expression to be subtracted and just add both the expressions. We can add or we can subtract by using horizontal method or column method. Now, let's get started. How to subtract monomial by monomial? Subtract negative 5x from 2x. So, here we have to write first 2x minus negative 5x. Already we have discussed 2x we have to write as it is and the subtraction will become addition because the subtraction means addition of additive inverse and negative 5x we have to change it into its negative uh, into its uh, additive inverse so the negative 5x will become positive 5x now we have to add just add 2x plus 5x both are like terms and here 2 is the coefficient numerical coefficient and 5 is the numerical coefficient so just we have to add both the numerical coefficient 2 plus 5 that's equal to 7 and x so this is the result of this subtraction now multinomial by multinomial if we are subtracting two multinomials multinomials means the polynomial which are having which having more than one terms here let us subtract these two expressions so let us first write the expression from where we have to subtract 2x cubed minus 5x square minus 11x plus 2 here we have to use column method and to use the column method what we have to do we have to arrange those expressions those terms in such a way that both the like terms will be arranged in one column that's why it is column method now 5x cubed what we have to write just below 2x cubed because these two are like terms 5x cubed now negative 3x square here we have to write negative 3x square and minus 8 or negative 8 here we have to write here like terms there is no like terms for neg negative 11x so just write ne just try just add 0 or you can subtract 0 now to subtract already we have learnt that to subtract we have to add the additive inverse so that each term of the expression what we have to subtract that change the each term into its additive inverse so here 5x cube will become negative 5x cube here negative 3x square will become positive 3x square now here it is 0 if we are adding or subtracting it uh, no changes here negative 8 will become positive 8 now just we have to add here 2 plus 8 that's equal to 10 here same negative 11 X here negative 5 and positive 3 just we have to add the numerical coefficient negative 5 and positive 3 that's equal to negative 2 and x square here 2 and negative 5 that means negative 3 x cubed so this is the result of this subtraction now in horizontal or row, row method just to write we have to subtract this expression from this expression so first you have to write this expression 2 x cubed minus 5 x square minus 11 x plus 2 this expression minus we have to subtract this expression 5 x cubed 
minus 3x square minus 8, negative 8. First, you have to simplify here. We have to just open the bracket. So, 2x cubed minus 5x square minus 11x plus 2. Now, while opening this bracket, we have to change each term inside the bracket, the sign. Or, we have to change into its additive inverse because one negative sign is there outside the bracket. Now, let's open the bracket. Here it is, 5x cubed is positive. That means, it, it will become negative 5x cubed. Here it is negative 3x square. That means, it will become positive 3x square. Negative 8 will become positive 8. Now, next step, just bring together all those like terms. 2x cubed minus 5x cubed, negative 5x square, positive 3x square, now negative 11x, it has no any like terms, now positive 2 and positive 8. Next step, we have to add these two expressions because these two are like terms and just add the numerical coefficient 2 and negative 5 it will become negative 3 x cubed negative 5 and positive 3 negative 2 x square and negative 11 x will remain unchanged because it has no any like terms now positive 10 2 plus 8 10 now this is the result of this expression in horizontal method or row method.